Welcome to Nicholas Eleminix 12. Today I'm comparing Nvidia's newly released GTX 1060 graphics card with AMD's RX 480. Both come in at much more interesting price points than the GTX 1070 and 1080 do, but what about the performance? Which of these two cards performs better overall? At the time of this video, the NVIDIA GTX 1060 does cost a fair bit more than AMD's RX 480. Please note that I'm testing the 4GB version of the RX 480 and not the 8GB one. Still, if we compared the 8GB RX 480 with the GTX 1060, the GTX 1060 would still turn out to be the more expensive GPU. Just not by that much more. Now let the battle begin! Very interesting. Now as you saw yourself, both graphics cards perform very well at 1440p. I was running the games at pretty much maxed out settings as always. However, it turned out the GTX 1060 is the better performer in every single aspect. Be draw gaming performance, so the frame rate, temperatures or power consumption. Let's face it, the GTX 1060 overall does better. But we need to consider the lower pricing on the RX 480 however, at least when it comes to the 4GB version. The price gap between the 4GB RX 480 and GTX 1060 is big enough to matter. So I'd say it's somewhat a tie, not really, but you know what I mean. However, things are getting a bit more complicated here, since the difference in price between GTX 1060 and the 8GB version of the RX 480 isn't that big anymore. Still, the RX 480's performance hardly will change when going for the 8GB model. It just gives us more headroom for higher resolutions and overall a bit more future-proofness in the VRAM aspect. So for short, with the 8GB RX 480 cost costing only a little less than the GTX 1060, I would say go for the GTX 1060 here. I should let you know that the GTX 1060 is equipped with 6GB of GDDR5 video memory though. 6GB is decent enough. Sure, the RX 480 also comes with an 8GB version. Well, in the end it's a really tough choice and it's up to you which card you find better. Another thing to factor in is power efficiency. While the RX 480 is quite efficient too, it by far can't touch the GTX 1060's power draw. And then when comparing performance performance per watt, that's a whole different story we aren't going to dive in for now. Right now I think we have to choose between the GTX 1060 and the RX 480 with 4GB of VRAM. Now I really hope I could help you with your decision. It truly isn't an easy one, but maybe this short video did help you out. Let me know. Thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe and visit my website to sometimes see videos there earlier.